Hey guys, let us solve this problem. So, a certain amount of ethane is confined in the bulb of full dealer capacity. The bulb is so weak that it will burst if pressure exceeds 10 atm. Initially, gas exerts 8 atm pressure at 27 degrees Celsius. So, find temperature at which the bulb will burst. Okay, so how many color temperature at which bulb will burst? And when will it burst? When the pressure comes exceeds 10 atm so initial pressure 8 atm hai so basically we have 8 atm se isko 10 atm pe lana hai pressure badhana hai koi burst hoga and volume is fixed 1 liter capacity so whenever volume is fixed and if you increase temperature pressure will increase right so how will we exceed this by increasing the temperature because p1 by t1 is p2 by t2 means Pressure is directly proportional to temperature. Jitna tum temperature badaoge, voi ratio se pressure badega. So P1 by P2 is nothing but T1 by T2. Right? Now we know that we badana hai P2 by P1. So 10 by 8 is nothing but T2 by T1. P2 is 10. This is 8. So 10 by 8 is T2 by T1. T2 is T1 initial 27 degrees Celsius but this temperature should be in kelvins so it is 300 kelvins so T2 will be nothing but 10 upon 8 times of 300 of course T2 will be more than T1 right so of course 1 se bada, 300 se bada hai hai. so the answer comes out to be 375 kelvin so 375 kelvin if you increase the temperature by 75 kelvin if you have 375 kelvin, there will be an increase in pressure from 8 to 10 atm. And this 10 atm will then result in bursting of the bulb. So you can see limiting condition is what? Volume remains constant. This was the catch of the question, right? First, why will the bulb burst? Because the volume is fixed, right? The pressure is more. So to, you know, whenever temperature is more, volume generally increases. But volume is more. Fixed one liter capacity fixed over right, so that will like, help that will result in bursting of a bulb. So the molecules which are present in bulb, you suppose bulb, the molecules which are present in the bulb. If you increase the temperature, this will have some energy, kinetic energy, and this will all tend to move away, and that's why this bulb bursts. So that's the logic behind all this. Hope you guys understood this video. Thanks for watching.